This tutorial will present the ticker type of project. Ticker projects works by reading the information from txt or rtf files and displaying the content by crawling across the screen. The files are processed following the named order. We will start this example by making a ticker project. After clicking on new project button, we will choose ticker type from the wizard dialog. In this example we will use text files so we need to select the corresponding option of the dialog. The project may be set to use RTF files instead text to extend the graphical possibilities. Make sure that you have selected the folder that contains the text files. You can select if the text files will be deleted after being displayed or will be recycled. The separator between messages can be edited. After creating the project, a corresponding entry will appear in the projects list. The preview of the ticker is activated automatically. The project already contains a ticker item that's basically a 2D text item that has the property to scroll at a given speed. By assigning a negative value, the ticker will change the scrolling direction. You can change the starting location of the ticker by changing the X position. You can set the draw area to make the ticker to display partially on the screen. A ticker can be edited in the same way as a 2D text item. It is possible to change the font. You can also change the color and the transparency of the font. For border and shadow, you can set the desired size, color and transparency. By modifying the shrink value, you can change the aspect of the font. In order to improve the visibility of the ticker, a rectangle is usually added to the project. The rectangle must have the hold stage set to infinite loop in order to be kept on screen indefinitely. If there are no text files in the assigned ticker message folder, all the items associated with the ticker will not be displayed, even if the ticker is started. When the folder is replenished with txt files, the scrolling will start automatically. By clicking on refresh button, the modifications will be sent on errand to the live manager application. The project can be controlled in the same manner from project list or from the live manager application. The live manager offers you the possibility to change the speed on the fly and to put the project in a pause state. In pause the ticker will stop displaying. When the resume is clicked, it will display again, starting with the last message that has not displayed completely.